another dream I had, you know, that the devil is in this guy's worn. Like, he's attacking really hard. I had that dream, too. You know what I'm saying? And he had his tongue out and the other thing. It was nasty. I don't know what that lane did. It was crazy, y'all. We all need to understand. The devil's not your friend. Saying is not your friend. Jesus, Lord Almighty, is your friend. God is your friend. And if we have, if we we must stay, we must try our best each and every day. We must have a prayer life. We must have a relationship with God. We must continue doing right with Him. Because no matter what we're going through in life, yes, it's gonna get hard. It's gonna get hard. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes, you know what? Things that in life don't matter no more. See, I became where sometimes it's hard to deal with things. But you know what? We have to confront it. You know what I'm saying? Confront the stuff and tell them to get out. And try our best each and every day. You know what I'm saying? God is God is truth and um you know what I'm saying? And the devil try to will bribe you to anything. Be careful not boasting and be careful not doing that. Don't think that you're doing better than next because I'm not doing better than next. You know what I'm saying? I'm not better than anybody. You know what I'm saying? I do have my sins and I do have my flaws. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm not going to claim that I'm perfect, you know, either way it goes. You know what I'm saying? But, you know what I'm saying? The stuff is real that, you know what I'm saying? I'm here to take responsibility and tell you that it hasn't been easy for me. You know, the devil's on a prowl. And we try our best, you know, to whatever case it may be. Um, Texas, you know, I say I, I hope and pray that you guys, you know, are doing, y'all do well and get better. And anybody that's going through it. You know, staying out of trauma or any stress or anybody. I don't want people to get, you know, you know what I'm saying? I hate to see what women go through and see what men go through. You know what I'm saying? It's not right. We should love one another. You know what I'm saying? Love God and love one another. That's the top two commandments that we need to follow. Um, you know, fellowship is important, but we must have the right fellowship. Um, but it's for people, we all, everybody, we, we all need to get together, you know, like, you know, whatever case may be, whatever's got going on is wrong to rape somebody. It is wrong and it's wrong to, you know, harm somebody. Some people don't want to be touched, you know, saying we're adults and, you know, there's some kids that get along, you know, saying, you know, saying it shouldn't be about you know, race. It shouldn't be what you look like. It's not about flesh and blood, you know. It's about spirituality and principalities, you know, and um, regardless, you know, say, be thankful. Regardless, you know, say, I'm thankful that I woke up today, you know, saying, yes, I, and I didn't need a lot of repentance and reapproval, you know, saying, I mean, because I'm human. But, you know, saying, but God's love will, will always win. And sometimes that they try to um shut your eyes and try to hurt you or try to, there's some things that the evil don't, but you cannot let them beat you. Because you see, um, no matter what you're going through in life, just know you're not alone. But it gets hard. But guess what? With God, you know, He'll protect you through everything. Trust God. Because He gives you fresh breath. You know what I'm saying? Every day, that's a way that they're God. God loves us, and we live through purpose. And no matter what we're going through, you we gotta we gotta understand. So you know, I know there's a lot you know saying that um that's going through it, going through depression or going through something. But um, it's wrong. You know, what I'm saying you know it's wrong, and a lot of people have trust issues and stuff like that. Um, the only way to get better is follow through Christ, the Christ Jesus. You know what I mean? And saying we can't, you know, 
let anything get in our way in our walk with Christ. See, me, you see, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not perfect. But we got to understand that the truth is the truth. The Bible is the truth. Holy Spirit is the truth. He, Jesus is the only way to the Father. He's the only way. And, um, and we must follow. Because, you know what I'm saying, prayer life, talk to him, have conversation. You know, the Bible, yes. And, you know, say sometimes, you know what I'm saying, if you feel discouraged reading, sometimes we got to understand that the enemy, the enemy as well would want to use it too. Because I noticed that too. The enemy will try to do that too. Just try to block you out. Of that, but don't let that discourage you. No, God had promised to love you. He's a very forgiving, he's a forgiving father. And no matter what, he loves you. You know, he's not a hateful God. He's not about killing destruction. He's about saving the world. And that's what he's about. The enemy will do anything to discourage you. To make you fear, to do anything in their power to hurt you, manipulate you, lie to you. See, I could be forgiving, forgiven, and the next minute, you know what I'm saying, the enemy will try to make you think, oh, you did something very horrible. How many chances, like they say, oh, you get one strike. No, you know what I'm saying, we all have plenty of strikes. You know what I'm saying, no. God loves me. God loves you. I'm talking to people that are want to follow righteous with God and everything else. And who's going through it. God loves you. It's not about flesh and blood. I'm talking about God just don't like the either the, the sins, you know what I'm saying? But he loves the you know, he loves us. He don't like the evil. He don't like that. But it's up to us to understand. He's not for. I just he's here for the sins to repent. That's it. And I'm repenting and I've asked forgiveness. It's up to us that we do. And um we shall also get together in whatever case we be. But this is what's happening. I you know, say I get these crazy dreams, and sometimes I'd be awkward to say it. But these are my dreams. Just in case, you know, saying it is what he wants me to say. Or whatever case may be. But I'm going to take my responsibility. And I have. And I want to say. You're not alone. Trust me. But just remember. Handle your burdens and everything else. Hand it all to God. And everything else. Take. take you know look, Just take. Take it. You know. I'm trying to tell you. And. Um, keep focus on God through the storm. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying myself as well. You know what? And you know what? It's okay. Don't beat yourself up. Because he loves you. Trust that. Because you wake up, you get to breathe, right? He loves you. <laughs>